Let's briefly discuss the V and V model in the context of system validation and change control. The first V represents system validation. Initially, we need to check if the system meets the specified requirements and ensures that the system satisfies regulated company needs and performs as intended in its designed environment. This is achieved through various testing activities. Once the system is validated, the maintenance process begins. The second V is related to change control. It involves assessing the potential impact of the change on the system's validation state. This includes checking if the modified components meet their requirements and testing the modified system to ensure correct functionality, thereby providing that the system remains in a validated state. That concludes today's presentation on CSV in a single PowerPoint slide. Thank you for your attention.